Hello, lovely. Are you all right? Good. Yeah, I'm good, thanks. Well, I must say, it is nice to finally meet you. I've been looking forward to this day for so long. <laughs> Thank you so much for choosing me to style you. It really does mean a lot. So, you have got a red carpet event, is that right? And it's your first. Okay, no pressure then. <laughs> so, I will obviously be going to be styling you, but I know we have gone through outfits already. So, are you still looking at those three dresses in particular? Okay, you are. So you've got three dresses, that's fine, and they're all black. Okay, so that's fine. And shoes, are we still looking at the black sandals or are we looking at something else? Okay. Okay, so that's good. Right. And your hair, what are we doing with that? Are we going up, down, or... Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so, again, it will depend on which dress that you do choose, but I'm quite liking having it up in a nice bun, having some little bits down and then some little fascinators throughout, something fancy or something like that, because you've got gorgeous tones in your hair and I want them to be seen. I mean, if you're going to get hot and stuff, you're going to want your hair up, which is a good idea. Yeah. Hmm. Because you don't want a hair trial, do you? Yeah, so then we can obviously make it a nice tight bun and wrap it round and make it like a proper kind of, you know, donut if you like and then really like scrape it back to you and leave the little bits down or we could clip those about the way but the way they look on your face I think that would go quite nice. We could have some drapey bits at the back. Yeah, but... Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. That's totally up to you. I mean, you could just keep it down and straighten it, or I could just curl it. Or, you know, I could just have a high ponytail or something else, really. I mean, if you... I would say up's probably going to be very practical, very elegant. And if you wear those black outfits that you show me, they are stunning. Yeah. And then a little black bag or something like that, little black sandals or something. Then maybe like little white fascinator or some little pins or something like that. Yeah. I mean, that's totally up to you. Yeah, you think so? I mean, I can book you in and we can do a trial and try some different looks. Or are you not as fussed about your hair, if that makes sense? Yeah. Well, that's why I was like, send me pictures over of what you like, what you don't like and things. Because obviously things like that are easily like corrected, you know? Yeah. So you don't want to do anything excessive buns, curls, pins and all that kind of stuff. You just would think you'd like me to do a big scrape up, a nice good solid bun and then just some little bits down and then leave it like that, all stuck to your head. Okay, I can do that for you. Yeah, that's fine then. I can do that, no problem. Okay. Okay, so we'll do the makeup trial then and get all that done so I know what I'm doing. And then when I see you next will actually be the event. So what we could do then is I will obviously do your hair, do your makeup, then we can pick your dress and then you'll be on your way. I know, it's really exciting. Okay, so hopefully nothing will change between now and then. Okay. Good, so I'm happy with that, my lovely. As long as you are perfectly happy with it too. Okay, good. Right, can I have a look at your veins? Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, what kind of um, shades do you usually wear for jewellery? Are you more of a silver girl or are you more of a gold? Right, I'm just going to place this here.
Do you know what jewellery you're wearing, if any? Okay. Okay, that's fine. Okay, pop your wrist there. Thank you. wide for me, your eyes, that's it. And what colour would you say your eyes are? Okay, I have to agree. And what kind of foundation shade would you usually wear? Yeah. I'm thinking there's a couple of shades that you might be bad. I'll check.
what kind of shades do you usually wear for eyeshadow? Yeah. shades do you think you're wanting to wear? Okay. Right, I'm going to look at these three shades for the moment. Right, let's do some swatches. those three just soak. Yeah, they're quite similar. Which one would you normally kind of go towards? Yeah, that's the one that I am thinking, to be honest with you. I do have other shades in between if I need to, but I'm usually quite good at kind of guessing, you know. So whilst that is soaking, let me have a look now. If you're wanting to go for kind of red and different things like that. This is a gorgeous palette. So, it's got different cherry kind of colours in. It's one of my favourite palettes. I have so many palettes, but so many of my favourite.
So I would have something like this kind of all over your lid, all right, as a base, kind of just all the way. I mean, do you want to go down the darker tones or you want to keep in the low, lighter tones or... I mean, that would be stunning. Maybe those two. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I can have a little swatch for you if you want. Um. Okay. You could swatch it on your arm or mine, it's up to you. I mean, I could do it on mine, I just sometimes I like to try it on you know, my clients so they can see it against their skin tone. Yeah? Okay, perfect. Okay. Can I have your arm, please, lovely? Okay. Okay. This one. See, that's nice, isn't it? Yeah. And this is a good one. Okay, so that's good too. Okay, so we're liking this and this so far. Okay. Let's try one of the other ones. Um, let's do a light shade. Yes, yeah, so that's good. That looks nice on you as well. Those two are quite good, actually. They might go well. Yeah, so these two are quite good. And keep that in mind. I think that'd be quite nice. Mm. Um, something like this might be all right. Again, it's just Depends what type of look you're wanting to go for. Let me just get this and that like that. Okay. Okay. I mean, I like that. This is nice, that's nice. You could do this all over. Have some of this in somewhere, maybe a couple of these. Maybe in that. Not feeling that as much. Okay. either. Okay. 
Okay, so this is a stunning palette. And it's just for a queen as yourself. <sighs> okay, see what I mean? Stunning, right? Mm-hmm. Exactly. So I am thinking use this palette right, if you just rest your arm just there for me thank you so we've got this nice shade yep okay and um, we've got that one mm -hmm. this one are they good? Let's try this on. Okay. Okay. You can take your arm back. It's fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, they're so stunning, aren't they? So many different ones that you could go for. I mean, are you wanting to go for a glittery look? Are you wanting a, a matte look? Are we wanting a bit of both? Okay. What I'm thinking then, what we could do, like pale colour all over to set maybe something like main roll here so the lighter one this one and then we can bring in poison apple I'm thinking this shade and this palette is called if the crown fits so I think it's perfect for somebody that's going to a red carpet event and looking at those colors I quite think yeah maybe winging it and chronicles yeah or I could maybe do this one and that one together. Let me just have a look at this. Get your arm. Pop your arm just there for me. Thank you. Okay, let's try Kingdom. Yeah. Let's try Magic Mirror. Mm hmm. Hereditary. Oh yeah, that's lovely, isn't it? Okay, it's very goldy though. Are you sure about that? Okay, alright. Okay. Alright, you can pop your arm back, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. Right. I think I know what I'm going to be doing now. say a great deal about this event but can you at least say where you're going amazing absolutely amazing I know do you know who's going what, what kind of you know slabs and things are okay I'm gonna remove that all right
Okay, lovely. So is it like a, like a ball kind of thing or yeah exciting and what are your nails like that's a good question okay so you're going for french okay classic french lovely love it right my love so okay so we're going to go with this one and that shade i like a matching concealer So eyeshadow. I'm going to pop on a little bit of eyeshadow, I think, my love. Okay, so I'm going to do one one side, I think, and one the other. Okay, let me just get my proper eyeshadow brushes. Right. Done to your brows on the day, my love, and your lashes. Yeah, okay. So, you're gonna have them lambed, tinted. Okay, okay. What about your um, lashes then? What about your lashes? Okay. So we are having brow lamb. So we're having them lifted and tinted. Okay, so I can just go brush them up nicely. Lashes you're going to have lifted and tinted, so we will need to pop on some, some mascara still. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to pop on some of this folklore, I think. Let me have a look. Okay, let me try the beast. Or oh, abracadabra. I think that's a bit too, yeah, that's too yellowy. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with folklore. Can you keep your eyes closed for me? Thank you. your skin tone. I'm going to do this one the same. Okay, 
close your eyes Thank you some of this one and I'm going to use a small one to that I think now this is bluebird this one even though it's not even a blue colour but okay Love it. Love it. Okay, then we're going to pop on. I'm going to use a bit of royal status, I think. And then I want to get a bit more of that original colour Perfect, have a look in the mirror, what do you think? Yeah, right, good So what we did, this all over this over the whole lid then I brought in this in the corner but then went over with that in the corner and then the other corner we brought that in instead and then blended them together with this and then we popped a little bit of that on in the middle okay now would you like me to do a different look on the other side it's totally up to you um, I could do We could use Renaissance instead, instead of Kingdom, or Magic Mirror. Yeah? Okay, cool. So, we're going to go in with... Mm, to add more of that, I think. Using 
Baroness. Sorry to talk to myself quite a lot. I'm happy with that. I'm bringing this other one on the other side. I'm liking that. Good. Then I'm going to bring in Magic Mirror. Have a look in the mirror and see what you think. You like them both? Okay, well that's good. Which do you prefer? I mean, I like them both, but I mean, we could even mix it up. I mean, we could do a bit of both on each, do you know what I mean? you're preferring. So let me just show you Magic Mirror on here. And then I'm going to show you Kingdom. Okay, so that is Magic Mirror that is kingdom so they're very similar but yeah okay right have a think what do you think okay we'll keep them on and i'll do the rest of the other ones and then we can go from there okay good right i'm going to just pop on foundation it's definitely a perfect match.
perfect. I'm happy with the base, looks good. So I now will apply some blush. We have this gorgeous rose blush and we have this gorgeous bronze forever sun kissed I'm thinking of using those two on I think they would look quite nice mm, I like those and we do have other ones obviously but I'm just loving those so I think they'll look really nice on you let me just get a big brush I'll say big it's not quite big but you know. I can always use cream products as well if you're wanting me, me to I don't mind or powders whichever suits you really okay all right smile Stunning. I love it. Yeah, I like that. It's really nice. Elegant. Okay, let me just put on. I love that. Yes, that's perfect. Let me pop a little bit of this on. You ready? I mean, we could go down the road with full on contour, you know, proper contour sticks and things like that, or we can keep it quite smooth, quite natural with just the bronzers doing the contouring, if you know what I mean. Yeah. on the nose as well um. okay. I mean you're quite youthful and you know powder looks quite good on you do you know what I mean yeah No, I don't think I like that one actually. I'm, too good. I'm just wondering if I'm bringing something a little bit different in. I'm not sure which will look good. Maybe a little bit of this actually. This might work. Um, Well, relax. Yes, I like that much better. She 
got a bit of highlight there now as well. Have a look in the mirror, see what you think. Yeah. I can use this gorgeous setting powder on you because it looks stunning on you. your eyes. have one that you want to actually wear yourself then please bring your own as well as obviously your more eyeliner if you'd like me to do any eyeliner some of my clients like to bring their own you know that's totally up to you okay that's fine so if you can bring your own, then that's fine. If you've got one in particular that you want me to put on, then that's fine, my love. Okay. Blank. 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 Okay. There we go, my love. Obviously, once they're lifting tinted, it's going to look awesome. Then, if you bring your mascara and your eyeliner that you're wanting me to use and for your eyeliner would you like me to do white underneath or are we going black all the way under are we having just a slight bit in the corner and then the rest white or just a slight bit of black in the corner okay yep i can do that for you with this one here okay And if you do change your mind, you know, just make sure you've got it with you. Okay. Okay. And lipstick. Will you be having your own lipstick, I'm assuming, so you can take it out and about? Okay. What kind of shade would you be using? Are we going for a red? Okay. Have a look. Which do you prefer? Good choice. Me too. You look stunning. Obviously, I would make sure I layer it enough to make it last and make it nice and bold. And yeah, which eye are you more swaying towards? Okay, 
so you're happy with that we're definitely going with that one are we happy with the bronzer the blush okay concealer yeah good perfect and foundation and, and that eye good okay wonderful make sure I know everything okay so you're going to have your own black mascara and eyeliner okay and your own red lip okay that's fine that's good uh, as I said you'll have your brows done so all I do I need to brush them up which I do I won't need to curl your lashes because you already have them lifted so that's fine Again, obviously on the day, we can tweak a little bit as well if you are still unsure. Okay, so, are you happy with how your makeup is going to look? Perfect. Now, knowing what your face is going to look like now, how do you feel you want your hair? Okay, good. Well, I can do that for you. All right, not a problem at all. All right, and you're still unsure on which dress? okay well obviously what i will do when i see you is obviously i will show you the dresses and the shoe choices that you've got yeah and then obviously i'll help you put on any jewelry i will obviously do your hair and do your face and you know make sure you are looking amazing ready for that limousine all right it's going to be the biggest night of your life all right amazing so when i see you next then it's going to be a big night you're looking forward to it I know it's only a month away, isn't it? How exciting. I know, so we've got to be doing your makeup, hair, putting your clothes on. It's going to be amazing. Okay, are you happy? Good. Please, any problems, just send me a message, lovely, all right, and I can happily come and see you again. All right. You are very, very welcome. You take care now. Bye-bye.